INQ delivers first overseas ion trap to Switzerland, progressing development of quantum innovation hub for EMEA. So EMEA stands for Europe, Middle East, and Africa. And as of late, INQ has been making some pretty big moves over there, as they have now announced the delivery of their ion trap to the European Quantum Data Center in Quantum Basel, which is located in Switzerland. Now, the reason that this is so significant is because this delivery actually marks an important milestone in the manufacturing of INQ's most powerful and scalable system, which is INQ Forte Enterprise, which will scale to 35 algorithmic qubits and is capable of processing over 34 billion different possibilities simultaneously. And one aspect that makes INQ's computers so unique is that while other quantum developers use quote unquote synthetic quantum qubits to form the basis of their quantum systems, INQ's systems are built around naturally occurring qubits, which are individual atoms. And these atoms are turned into ions and trapped in 3D space where lasers do everything from initial preparation of the atom to the final readout to deliver accurate results. And it's the speed, accuracy, and scalability of INQ's trapped ion systems that make them ideal for both research and enterprise applications. Moreover, the entities that are going to benefit from all of this, at least in this case, will be European businesses, government agencies, and research institutions, all of which are going to have enterprise-grade direct access to INQ's systems when developing applications for highly complex problems in fields like AI, finance, and chemistry. INQ even has specialists working out of the company's Basel, Switzerland headquarters and will be on site to receive the ion trap and continue the build and commissioning of the system. And President and CEO of INQ, Peter Chapman said, and I quote, Today's delivery of our first overseas ion trap marks a critical step in our partnership with Quantum Basel and our commitment to building best-in-class quantum computers that meet the requirements of performance, scalability, and enterprise-grade solutions. This achievement brings us one step closer to providing direct access to INQ's high-performance systems to organizations across Europe. Alright, so if you'll recall, the partnership between INQ and Quantum Basel was first announced last year and leverages the strengths of both organizations to drive more innovation in quantum technology. And as part of this collaboration, Quantum Basel will offer something called Uptown Basel, which is an international center near Basel that houses enterprises, research institutions, startups, and even universities and, of course, has direct access to the 35 qubit count Forte Enterprise system. And if that wasn't enough, INQ will also deliver a future 64 qubit count system through this partnership. Even the CEO of Quantum Basel, Demir Bogdan, has gone on record saying this, The arrival of INQ's Ion Trap and the progress the teams have made to construct our first quantum system is a testament to the strong partnership between INQ and Quantum Basel. We are excited about the potential this technology brings to our commercial and research endeavors. Alright, so I think if anything, it's good to look at this latest update as an important investment in the future of quantum in areas beyond the United States, and further cements the collaboration with other nations that INQ will be receiving. I mean, INQ really is moving at a rate that's hard to keep up with sometimes. So to see their latest milestone that they achieved, watch this video next where I go over some massive improvements that they've had. Anyway, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you next time.